Hi guys, I had a two and a half hour conversation recorded with the person making the Chinese counterfeit magic cards. Uh, the video is the video now is our Skype conversation via text and my website, which only changed my name and my email. Everything else is the same. The link to the information is learningkitty.com. I did try to reach out to some of the bigger websites and no response. I contacted Delson Del Del Huang uh, pertaining to be a massive buyer of counterfeit cards. Delson is the owner of the printing press that is making the high quality fakes. I learned a lot about how these cards are being sold and made. Currently, the only there's only a few counterfeits on the market. The current counterfeits are due to someone tricking Delson into sending free samples and this person selling on eBay. So it's just one person really. Uh, this person did not pay Delson at all. The cards are being shipped in 55 packets, 55 cards a packet, but Denson says they have a new list of 80 cards which is at the bottom of this of the website. A thousand packets will be made and shipped on January 19th. Interesting enough, the majority seem to be going to Brazil and Spain. Uh, there are no big buyers at this moment. The most am amazing part of this conversation is that they are getting better by learning from the how to spot a fake articles. They are well aware these articles exist. For 100,000 cards, they charge $10,000. For 1,000 comic books, they charge $450. And for a packet of 55, it is $25. I got the address to the facility and you know the Skype and the website. The PayPal account, email, his name, his personal email, what university he even went to, what city he lives in. I also found out how he's shipping them, what countries are receiving them, and what his plan is to continue printing in kind of in secret, and he has no intention of quitting, he's just telling people that, like some people who have been telling you, hey, it's safe, he's quitting. No, he's not quitting. He was willing to print me 200,000 in like two weeks. I attached the original emails as well as the entire Skype conversation. The only thing that has changed is the name and email to protect my privacy. I made two promises to my subscribers when I made this channel. One is that I don't feed until you feed. The other is older and from new law student. And that is to be honest. I'm not sponsored. I have no incentives. I did imagine, it did cross my mind to fire sale all my cards right now. But that wouldn't be honest. I'm holding on to all my cards. No buy list, no MOTL for now, no eBay, obviously. And the hopes that Wizards will get this and shut Denson down before the 19th, which is the first massive shipment. The second massive shipment would be on the 23rd, I believe, before holidays, and that's for 100,000 cards, I guess. I also hope the community will share this with Wizards as an emergency by tweeting, writing emails, forwarding this video. I don't know. I've done all I can. And they are going to print the Black Lotus and Time Walk soon.